What is your first memory of uh, Rocky Balboa? Oh, my dad. My dad popping in uh, via chess tapes <laughs> and saying, son, man, take a look at this. We're going to watch Rocky, you know? Um, so so, so those, those, those movies, those movies, um, the character of Rocky, they just, they just, you know, it's just, they just represent my dad for me. I have so many memories of it, but, but I remember in a palpable way just the love story between he and Adrian. To me, it, it almost took me a while to remember that the first Rocky movie was even about boxing. I didn't even remember any of the boxing sequences until I went back and watched them after getting this, after getting this role. Because to me, it was just a love story about, about this sort of odd couple, about these two very different people falling in love and, and making each other better because of it. First memory of Rocky Balboa, probably sometime in high school, freshman, sophomore year. Uh, just uh, when I first hear, when I, when I hear the word Rocky, I think of inspiration, underdog. You know, just kind of like you know, the, you know, everyday guy. You know, putting his pants on one leg at a time, and but just having this drive and determination to, you know, to to succeed and his will and leaning on the people that he cared about. You know, to 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 get to get through these tough situations. There's a great chemistry between you and Alan Sylvester Stallone. Yeah, he reminds me of one of my uncles, man. Like, the first time I met him, you know, we're sitting there talking about sports and, you know, storytelling, and we start roughhousing and stuff and playing around, and he's, he's, he's a guy's guy, you know? So he's one of those dudes who you could, you know, be honest with, and, and he has tons of stories. I mean, he's been doing this for 40 years, so just just listening, you know? When, you, when you're around somebody, you know, like your grandparents or, you know, older uncle who's lived so much life, it's, like, always cool to kind of be around and just, like, soak up that info. You gotta work hard. I swear to God, if you're not gonna do it, I'm out. Like every punch I ever thrown has been on my own. Nobody showed me how to do this. I'm ready. I mean, they're very similar in many, in many, in many ways. Um, they both, they both have a, uh, they both have just a great passion for acting. They both have a. Uh, uh, the, the it factor, you know, like when you meet when you meet those guys, you 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 uh, that charisma is just off the, off the charts, you know. If they if, if they they could be bagging groceries somewhere or something, and it's, they're, they're the kind of people that you that, that 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 you remember, you know what I mean? You know, working with them both is hard work too, because they're gonna come to set with, with with all kinds of questions, with all kinds of ideas, and you got to be able to know which ones to say yes to, you know, which ones to say maybe to, which ones to say no to, and and and, and then when you say no, you got to be able to back up, you got to be able to back up why, you know. <laughs> Is it easier for you playing uh, Rocky when you're not directing yourself? Well, yes and no. It, it's of course it's a lot less fatiguing, but you just have your opinion. Oh, maybe we should put the camera over there, and, and you have to say, it's not, "You're not directing this one." So, but I got used to it after a while. Creed does a wonderful job of coming full circle. Mm -hmm. Is it full circle? Or is it a new beginning? New beginning. I think I think it's a new beginning. I think it's uh, the perfect blend between you know what Rocky left, you know, and um, and then it's the passing the torch to something new. It's just a new beginning. I I think, and that's why I like the way it ended, because now you can develop new characters, new ambitions, new fears, and his girl. It's not like Adrian. Adrian was sad. Adrian was called a loser by everybody. So was Rocky. So they were two lost people. These people aren't lost. She wants to be a singer. She has talent. He's young. He's handsome. He comes from a royal family. Different story. Big, yeah, where they can go, I'm not even sure. There are some things that are full circle about about it in some ways. I think if you've been following the franchise and the history for the 40 years, then there's something sort of remarkable about watching this hero in the form of Rocky sort of be fallen for a minute and, and see what happens as he graduates into another chapter of his life. Um, but no, I think, I think it's the beginning. To me, instead of looking at it as the next Rocky, it's the first Creed. A great fighter once said, it ain't about how hard you can hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. Oh.